morning. Actually, it's about three o'clock in the afternoon, but today is February the 1st, and uh, 2016, I might add. Now, anyone that knows anything about my videos will know that a year ago today, I made a video walking around a park in Darwin, where I used to live. Now in Finsbury Park in North London, which is where I live now. And today is the second anniversary of stopping smoking, which is ace because I used to smoke like a chimney, as I'm sure a lot of you know who know me will know that. Cigarettes and weed and all the rest of it. And uh, so to do 730, is that right? Yeah, 730 days of no smoking. And the cigarettes that I used to smoke cost £6.30 a box. And I used to smoke 20 a day. £6.30 times 730 is, I think I've got this right, I think it's 4,599. Uh, yes, it is. I don't know if you can see that. 4,599 quid. That's how much I haven't spent on cigarettes. If you take into account the amount of money I used to spend on weed, my gosh, it must be at least that same amount again. You're probably looking at 10 grand that I haven't spent on smoking. If you're making that decision to quit, you've got to ask yourself, anyone who's looking to quit smoking, I mean, it's the 1st of February today, what a great day to start if you try to tried to start on the 1st of January as a New Year's resolution and failed like I did. Today is a great day to start. I've said all this before, but, you know, anyone who's looking to quit, ask yourself this question. <laughs> Which would you rather have, cancer or cash? Ask yourself that very simple question. Cancer, because obviously cigarettes give you cancer, and everybody knows that, even those who smoke know that. Or cash. Just think. Uh, one pound short of four thousand six hundred pounds in just two years, and those two years have flown by. They really have. They really have flown by. And um, you know, what can you do with that amount of money? I'm not saying I've kept that amount of money in a jar, but what I'm saying is, if you gave up smoking and you did, every time you went to the shop to buy cigarettes and you decided to put that money aside instead. In two years' time, if you'd smoked Pall Mall like I did, the shit fags, <laughs> you'd have, you know, just under £4,600. Think about that. Because that's an ins stupid amount of money. You know, what, you know, you know it's literally burning money. You go to the shop, buy cigarettes, you smoke them, and then what happens? You go to the shop, buy some more, smoke them. Because you're chemically addicted to nicotine. <laughs> Whether you admit it or not, you're chemically addicted to nicotine. And uh, looking to quit, start today, you know, make a video, make a diary like this, that's all I've been doing, started off, you know, a few days, a couple of weeks, 28 days, a couple of months, six months, a year, don't think I've made one for a year, you know, I said in that last video I made last year, you know, it won't be long until I'm walking, making another video, you know, on the 1st February 2016, and that day has arrived, <laughs> and here I am. <laughs> So, give up smoking. It's the best thing you'll ever do. And it was a piece of piss. I didn't use any of this Nicorette gum or patches or vape. You know, that's just, that's just stupid. <laughs> Stop buying cigarettes. That's what you've got to do. You know, problem solved. You only buy them because you got into the habit of buying them. which would you rather have, cancer or cash? It's a question that's, uh, you know, doesn't really take a lot of thinking about, you know. Hmm, let me think. Uh, cancer or cash? Um, you know, obvious really, which would you rather have?
know, make a public declaration, say, I'm going to quit smoking. You'd be surprised how many people will uh, support you, say, good on you, I wish I could. And then you can make videos telling them how easy it was to make. Chances are it'll happen to you, and it's two years, 730 days of breathing oxygen. It's great. Obviously, I know in London the, uh, you know, the, the air is, is mostly pollution, but it's the concept, you know, no smoke, no coughing, you know, I haven't been coughing, I haven't been, uh, you know, my breath doesn't stink, because if you smoke, trust me, your breath stinks. smell the breath of somebody that smokes, trust me, your breath stinks. <laughs> and you don't want people thinking that you stink, because that's not good, is it? But just quit. It's the easiest thing you'll ever do. Willpower alone. You know, you don't need to buy nicotine. You don't need to do any of that stuff. You just tell yourself that you're going to stop smoking, and stop smoking. And that's all there is, all there is to it, really. It's all there is to it. It's the easiest thing you'll ever do save a shitload of money, you'll be healthier, and you know, chances are you won't get cancer, because you know, if you're not putting, you know, poisonous chemicals into your lungs, you know, that, you know, save money and improve your health, two, 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 you know, two for the price of one, it's a double whammy of great things, you know, why, why not, why not do something that's going to benefit, benefit your health, why not do something that's going to benefit your finances, you know? Everyone wants to have more money, and everybody wants to be healthier, you know. Unless, of course, you, you want to die and be skinned, which then crack on, you know. Spark one up right now, but um, I'm pretty sure that you don't. So, today is the 1st of February, 2016, and this is Dan Fossard, and it's two years to the day since I quit smoking. It's a mega achievement, and I'm well proud of myself. If I can do it, anyone can do it, especially you. Whoever you are watching this, if you smoke, I challenge you to quit today. I challenge you to stop smoking. Make a diary. Put it on Facebook. Put it in the comments. You know, put it on YouTube. Put a link in the comments underneath this video. Let me know. Because I've had other people watching my videos about the stop smoking saying, I really like your videos. They're really good. And they inspire me to, to stop. You know, which is great. Because why not do something that's good? Inspire somebody else to do the same. You know? Share the love. It's all good. It really is all good. Stop smoking. how you know how much money is saved and uh, you know how he's got healthier and all the rest of it so it's easy it really is he did it by will and you know what i'm talking about so good on you wicked honestly all we've got to do is not buy cigarettes it's as easy as that i challenge you i bet you can do it make a diary and i'll see you later my name's dan fossil two years not smoking good day see ya